Today we're going to show you our mirror shield product that we have here at CUDA. Um, you may have seen them on the road, they're usually in yellow, that seems to be our most popular cover um, and they're usually on the back of mirrors because they are mirror protectors so if you've seen them coming down the road towards you chances are they've come from here. Um, we do have them for trucks and for vans, so the little one in the middle here is a van one. Uh, the whole point of mirror shield really was born through fleets um, asking us for uh, an alternative option to stainless steel guards. So traditional stainless steel guards have been around for a long time. Um, obviously they're quite heavy, they are effective, they do the job, um, but they, they are quite heavy and they do dent and they tarnish over time and things like that. So the fleets really wanted something that they could color code, um, make their own, sort of bring it in as part of the vehicle and also a safety feature as well. So the reason the high-vis yellow is so popular is obviously with a truck, especially going around towns where the roads are smaller or in the country, the mirrors are at a lower level. The yellow is nice and visible so the pedestrians are seeing, and then the cyclists, the other road users. It, it all has this aspect and this, um, this feel to it, which was all driven by them. So that's how we, that sort of led us to, to create this product. Now, Mirror Shield is um, specifically designed to each vehicle and each type of mirror for each vehicle as well. There are certain trucks that you know, we take the Actros for an example not the new one with mirror cam obviously but the older generation where you have a wide and a short armed mirror so we have to do two different types of guard for that but they're, they're all specific so it's not like you can they're just a universal flat piece that doesn't look very good we make sure we style everything to make it make it fit in with the vehicle um, every single one of them has a built-in reflector as well which again adds for visibility at night so if you're driving towards a vehicle and there's this nice shiny thing coming towards you on the very extremity of the vehicle, chances are you're going to try and avoid it. Um, now, Mirror Shield itself is made up of Kevlar and a GRP mix. Um, the Kevlar is used for strength. Obviously, Kevlar is what they make bulletproof vests out of. I'm not saying hide behind one of these, but, you know, they are strong. Um, we have what we call the impact area or the impact zone, which basically makes up the, the front or the little edge of the guard. Um, and is super strong so that's where most of the impact is going to happen be it another vehicle be it a branch that side of thing so this is the where the real strong section is we have these flutes as well um, they're there for increased airflow obviously around the guard they're there for styling but they also add a serious amount of strength because they are solid um, real solid pieces of the of the guard turning it over you'll see on the inside here so this is the reason this is kind of like a, a speckled finish is because it's the fiberglass. You can see the mat in there making up the structure. Um, we have our impact zone here, which is also lined with, with a rubber um, foam. So again, the, the guard or the housing of the guard sits nicely into the cover. And this just adds another 10 mil buffer zone. So if there is any impact, it's still gonna take some of that shock out before transferring the, the energy into the arms of the mirrors and swinging the guard in or the mirror in, I should say. Um, they clamp nicely around the arms, nice and easy. Again, they're molded, so it doesn't change. It only fits in one way. Um, usually between four and six bolts holding them on with nylocks. Super easy fit. You'll fit a set in <clears throat> 20 minutes quite easily. Um, yeah, like I said, going back to, to the colors we have here, we have the, obviously the white, the black, and the yellow. We can do them in any solid rail color that you require. So if your fleet is majority blue or red, then that's not a problem, we can do that. Um, that's all fine as well. So what we'll do is we'll, um, we'll take you outside in a second and just show you them fitted to a vehicle so you can get more of an understanding of how they actually look on the vehicle. Um, and then also from sitting inside the cab, just showing you that there is no additional blind spots there um, created by the guards, which is obviously everyone's main concern with these types of products, but they, are, they don't, don't create that. Um, lastly, the the thing with these is is that they, they weigh less than a kilo each so they're super light super strong but super light so if there is an impact um, they're going to absorb the impact protect the mirror and then when the mirror inevitably folds in because you will have an impact which causes the mirror to fold in there's not that additional weight there from say a stainless steel guard that could cause the mirror to swing in and smash the window which has happened it happens quite a lot and I'm sure maybe some of you have even had that happen to you and it's not a pleasant experience. Um, these should avoid that basically. So yeah, we have um, pretty much every truck and van covered. Um, if we don't have it, the chances are we're making it or in the development process of doing it. Um, we're also very aware that cameras are replacing mirrors. Mercedes 
great job on the mirror cam, um, but they're still gonna need protecting. So we are very close on launching our first camera protector, which will be for the Actros mirror cam. Um, they're a lot more expensive than mirrors, so you know it's worth protecting them. Um, and we hope to have that live for you very shortly, so make sure you keep an eye on the website for that one. Thanks for watching this video. You'll find further information on this product below. If you need any further help, please contact our sales team.